I couldn't finish using my hair in this video. In the next video, I'll have lose my hair. Finish! Hey guys, welcome to my channel. It's been a long time since I've completed a video, since my last video. So, today's video is just about life updates, what has been happening since, and why I didn't post since March to the other video that you guys saw, that mini vlog. So, very short here. Just, just like a little bit of my life is during summer. Yeah. So, we have a lot of things to do, starting talking about a lot of things, and I'm losing my hair because I want to make hair for my baby. So. That's why I'm losing my hair. And I think I got this since the beginning of January. I've just been on all back. If I'm not making braids, I'm on all back. That has been my get-to-go style. So now, we'll be talking about school life. Like, why I am attending a private uni. I don't know if most of you guys know. But I want to just just to people. Why I'm attending a private uni. Why I'm not going to. So, the university I planned on going to. Well, see, there's this thing called... Man, I don't know. Man opposes or something or God disposes. I don't know which of the which of it is correct, but plans change. Like I wasn't even expecting I was going to do. If someone told me in secondary school that I'd yeah, go to the private university, I'm like who and maybe because of the background or university I knew that like I'm so good. So maybe that's why I never liked the private university and I didn't want to go to one of the such. So when I'm sure something even happened recently. I've been breaking out like this plenty plenty old you can have big pimples right there well it's not it's not their fault it's my fault because i wasn't staying tuned to my spirit and there was a second sometimes i won't even do anything i'll just sleep we'll go like that to this old song and i'm looking at bond bond planting but that is by the way so i had to change i did change of the situation from I kept, my first choice was the rest of the learning so I did change of situation. I didn't know I was going to go there because when I told my dad about what happened, because a friend of mine told me about something that was happening. So I was so we think we rubbish English. We thought we're not going to like he learned was going to resume this year. Thought they're going to resume next year. So when I told my daddy about the updates, what she told me and everything, I'll tell you about what she told me and that's and that video, what she told me and everything. It was like, no, you can't write your pair, you can't do this, you can't do that. But we'll go to one, one school like this. And then I just came. It was just like, we are going to Lee City. My, my head was like, what, what was Lee City? I don't know what Lee City is. Doing. As far as I've been traveling to Lorraine by Road, I've never seen the school. Maybe sign, but like it's goes up, I don't know. But that was that. So we filled the form online at first. Then I noticed that the important is trash. Wow, beautiful. Because nothing could go on that portal. So we had to go physically. And my dad was also planning for his PhD, so he was also going to go to university. So two people going to two weeks before the yeah, second semester resumption. I'm saying that. Before they for second semester. So the school was going to be smart. And I noticed that not everybody went to the holiday. So I was in my old school. So the four bedded old school. Initially, we were told that it was for two beds, but when we were to do this in Nigeria, it's kind of like, The only available two beds was there was not um was not as much as four beds like the way four beds hostels were were so many in the school. So that's that reason for school, and I was rushed for school, so I only got most of couple rooms and my remaining housemates, and that's all I did. So in school, I was always dressing like a corporate student. I'll show you a picture of me there and everything. Well, classes started nine. Like it's always made me happy. Like classes started nine, so I was so happy. And feedbacks already were well, given to us that during their first semester, they started classes eight. So I was like, oh my god, now I'll also start eight. And I'm the punctuality student. Like I'm always one waking my friends up. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah, it's time to go to school. Oh yeah. Because I'm very heavy. Sometimes then uh, I remember one certain time my alarm could wake. I had like I don't even know what was wrong with me. I would set an alarm every every one one hour from two o'clock to five. I would just make the test. We're told a few days before we have the test or a week before we have the test, which was very nice of them. Not like it was an impromptu test of a thing. That thing I don't really like it. Oh 
there was a teacher, a lecturer that actually gave us improv to test. That was for media technology, the introduction to media. That man, we already know that every time we're having this class in the morning, we surely have tests. Sometimes I'm just praying to God, please don't let us have tests. But unfortunately, my prayer doesn't, doesn't even work at all. It doesn't work. We surely give us tests. Sometimes it may even not be, it's not even related to what you have to do. You have to do your initiative. Just think, like if you've read like a head kind of me, you know some things to write. So just try and use your number six, as you say, your senses. So that was that. And a lot of things were happening in school. Like a lot of events, parties, a lot, a lot. I knew a lot were going on. Like I could see it. that school bubbles a lot. And lucky thing about that. The universities are that you could actually go out. Like, they don't question you for going out of the gates. Like, the they won't ever ask, which was very surprising to me. As I was quite shocked that they did. So we could actually go out of school without nobody doing anything. They closed the hostel by 12. For recent updates, like around the May, June, they're closing the hostels by 10. I don't know if they did it. But they did not because there was one time I was lo- almost locked outside because of my shawarma search. Since the food was not as really, really, really like they hundred percent, hundred percent that we're just managing it just to survive their life because you've paid for it. If you don't eat, you have lost because your parents have paid accommodation plus feeding. So what is that? Except you are staying outside school, like you're living outside. The hostel, that's when I was okay. You know, we are making it food. If you don't eat, it's your problem, it's your business. You know, that was that. So, the menu was always the same. I think throughout my stay, what I ate the most, like when I was in, when I was in the school during that period, what I was always eating was jello fries. Amala, jello fries, amala, jello fries, amala. I didn't bought anything new because I was, I was afraid to try something new, to be very sincere because. I was afraid of trying to get new food. I don't know why. Just because it's not my regular like it's a, it's a new place. I can't really trust their food hundred percent. Yeah. So that what happened. Then what else again? So there was a period of time they introduced shawarma. Oh my god. And funny enough, it's like God sent this shawarma beast initiative to my life. Because one knew that Adia has been suffering. Has been not been happy with herself, like because in, in terms of food, actually, in terms of food wise, I wasn't happy. So, I think it was around that April ending. Then there's this shama spot that was introduced at our cafeteria where the two other guys were staying and other things staying. So, I switched from buying Friday um, with my ticket or regular business to buying shama because I could actually buy shama with my ticket. Is it I use ticket or cash? And me. And ticket squeeze you. So I was always having tickets. Even to you now, my friend always like, How come we still have tickets? We buy regular for you. You are always buying shawarma of one k one two sometimes. That what is happening with you? But they don't know the secrets. It's not everything I buy. Sometimes I just book for people and just go there and help them. So it got to a time that so someone started calling me NG, a friend of mine. She started calling me shawarma. Yeah, there's no time. My friend will see me or my friend will see me again. Don't you really buy something? We we'll only see it every damn day. I'm like, Are you serious? I'm not thing is that I may not even eat in the morning. After class, when I'm done, around the evening period, that's when I get to my shower. I'll have already booked for it. And I eat and sleep off. Period. It just makes me happy. So that was my happy new moment. Two summer came and they changed everything. And they're like, this is shower my sister. And I was so pissed off. I was like, what am I going to survive in this place? How am I going to survive? Oh my god. So my friend I was like, they never see me at the cafeteria. That what am I least eating? Let me tell you guys, I'm lazy eating. If I'm not eating Gary and Sue, I'll Gary and Kuli Kuli because I don't eat granola like that because sometimes of my eggs, pimples. I'm eating cornflakes like my cereals, rice crips. If I'm not eating rice crips, I'm eating bread. Like bread is my, hmm, more, my lifesaver. Save my soul. Bread was so this year my soul. If I wasn't doing toast bread, I was eating bread and tea. If I wasn't eating bread and tea, I was doing eating bread and butter. I was just eating something with bread. So I think that should be my food menu that was my regular food menu or oh, i buy food from this cafeteria outside the school so that was that and also during school period i contested for like a position yeah welfare welfare i can't even welfare and the funny thing about that was that i won like i was welfare too like thank you for those that voted every one of you i love you so much for voting for me like 
I didn't expect. Do you know this that day I went to the for a thing? Me, Loki, Loki. Why I went for that welfare stuff is because of what happened during dinner. Like I was so not happy. Like I don't know why the escorts were enjoying more than we that paid. And the funny thing you know that throughout we paid a certain amount of money and we didn't really enjoy. So it was really nice. Like it was really nice. So I was like, and my brain is like food. So I'm like, welfare food. Which we get up. Um, it's like I should go for this position. At first, I didn't want to raise up my hand when we asked that should we, if you want to participate and everything. I was like, let's just do it. And fortunately enough, I won. Like it was just so nice and it made me so happy. So I won. I won. So that what happened. Dinner party. I'd never planned for that dinner. That dinner was like no plan. If you see people's dressing again, again, I think. Dinner, students we people plan for you too. I didn't know that such a thing, such a thing I think that was the like people plan. This is the way they're giving us dresses back to back. The makeup, the everything, they the should be God. If you're not careful, you'll be oppressed, but I refuse to be oppressed. You understand the kind of thing? So that's there. So it was a week full of fun. That was students week. I really enjoyed myself like that. It was really nice. Then we started preparing for exams, and me, I'm this type of person that if I don't prepare early, that means I'm doing garbage in garbage. I'm like, like I'm like poor. Like I know definitely I'm cramming this thing. I don't want to understand it. Like that's it. I'm not like understanding anything. I was there. I was just like I'm going to cram. So to avoid that, and I I don't really like. I don't find it healthy because I don't like cramming. Yeah. So I decided to start reading early. You know, I went. I did with. I do. Did away my distraction. Like I had so many movies on my laptop that I could have watched so many series. The only one I knew I watched from beginning to end. I'm like, this I'm going to finish it. Was King Kona. Like I'm like I'm going to finish it. I think almost sometimes eh, I I remember I was having um, um, classes. I would sleep too quick. I was I'm going to finish it because I needed to finish it. So by April I was only watching all my movies. Any movie that was like was being shown maybe. People came to do sleepover in my night in my room and they were, my friends were watching movies that like I've watched it before or I just sleep off watching the movie. You understand that kind of thing? And it would be during weekends. So that was that. Preparing to go to for exam, always going to law theater to read and everything. And some a time I stopped preparing to I stopped I really feeling I didn't really find it nice because I needed to take my chair. And I remember just so much. I didn't even plan for taking my chair. But I think this time I need to plan for taking my chair so that it's kind of convenient for me. Reading, so we've not seen our second semester results. Boom, they said summer was starting, so summer started June 21st. I make I finish my exam June 15th, it's June 15th or 14th. So I think it was a Friday. I was so happy. I just folded my dad, like my dad also came to write. I just folded him, like, let's go together, let's go together. I just followed him back home, but I didn't take my leave because I knew I was coming back for summer. Like, you'll be asking me what is summer, I'll tell you later on. So I went to him and I was told that well summer is starting on Monday. People were like they were going to postpone the diary, everything, everything. You know, Nigerian I understand they'll be putting on it was reason So I had to rush back. I went it Thursday. So like I said I never went anywhere. Like I went it Thursday back to school. Like it, I was supposed to go on Saturday, but I didn't go on Saturday. I had to change my plans. I planned on visiting people. I changed everything and that was that. Summer is just I think this is how I can feel summer is summer. Is for people that maybe are carrying back courses, people that didn't write the exam, maybe first semester exam, second semester exam, and want to write it. And that's it. But they they incorporated it to new students because when they say admitting students, this is was like one of the schools that its portals were still open for admission. Do you understand what I'm saying? And you couldn't change your institution, do you grab? So they were having like more more students. I could definitely say that we were, some our students were far, far more than the regular. 100 level mass com students because they were 17 mass com students and some of them were like 29 like we're so much so summer classes started we're told that it's for five weeks two weeks no three weeks of lecture then two weeks of exam like, who does that like are you trying to play or joke with my brain yeah it's be sincere what really helped a lot practicing for tutorial questions sharing and everything upon that there were some topics i know how to crown there was this one Issue of Nigerian mass media. Hmm. God knows I crammed that thing. As my friend was explaining to me, me Gabby putting the dates in my brain, I was just like cramming a pole, like cram a pole. If you ask me, there was a question they asked about something, something, I can't remember. I shall roll since that blog Nigeria. If you ask me of that blog Nigeria, I can't tell you. 
I like I cannot. I like Roya newspaper. See, my brother can never see it. What I wrote today, I just like, oh Jesus, take control. So I can have a good grade. So I haven't seen my second semester exam. I haven't results, and I haven't seen my first semester exam results, which is summer. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. So that's wrap for school life. Let's go to another thing: skincare journey. So I was. I've been having breakouts since to since I don't know. Maybe since junior school, to senior school. So I told my auntie that I needed um, skincare for Nigeria. I didn't want to first start with Nigerian ones because I had one as I had first used one and I didn't like myself. I was always itching, reaction, and the content was black soup. So I was like, how am I reacting to this black soup? And normally I don't react to black soup, so I just stopped all this type of products and was just leaving my skin like that. So when the product finally got to me, like my mom sent it to me from my dad. I started using it and I was noticing change. Like I was regular, like I was consistent. Like, what is consistent? I was consistent in using it and it was really nice because I was like liking my skin. I like my skin. Like, I was like, wow, so this this face can be fresh without having giant pimples. So that's that. But right now I'll break out because I was, I'm not consistent again. Then for my physical journey, guys, I've gained weight. I don't know how I gain weight. I can't see the weight gain in me because I'm like, wait, I don't know where it is though. Because when I was using middle school, when they did the medicals for me, I was weighing 49 kg. But when I got admitted to the hospital, which was after my exams, that was my summer exams, which was last month, guys, I'm weighing 52 with 49. Hmm, 49, 50, it's not much for 52, it's good. I'm afraid of myself, so I'm not going to enter 56, 60, because, ah, yeah, God, so I feel I'm getting fat and I don't like it, eh? That's that. So, I've also been working on, what other things have I been working on? That's just it, for my physical, it's not going to be eating too much. Even yesterday, I didn't eat, I only had two months, I think. I've not been just having this urge to eat, because I'm like, I want to get fat, I want to just get fat. And I'm sorry to say, School actually changed my eating routine because normally in my house from 8 to 9, you're not expected to be eating. Charlie, in school, 8 to 9, I've not even eaten. Maybe I'm still thinking of when you brunch my brain, I'm like, oh, what would I eat to this? Oh, that's just me. Or maybe I'm just getting my shower. Can you imagine? So, definitely, people were having, <laughs> flat, I say flat tummy, big tummy, belly. Hmm. Some people that actually had flat tummy that weren't able to. Keep it and maximize it by going to the gym. Eventually, started having belly fats, and well, for some people, it can be discouraging. So, I like, go back to the flat belly journey. But me, I don't think I ever had a flat belly, but I was just conscious of my tummy. Yeah, so that's for the physical health and everything. And, everything. and I was sick. So, I was admitted in the hospital for close like three days. I could not be admitted. That's another story for another day. After this video, I'll be telling you a story then about what happened to me. Then my goals for the remaining part of 2021. Thank you guys for 175 subscribers. Like, I want us to have 200 subscribers before the end of this month. I don't know if that's possible because the days are, but I believe in God though. Like, I expect, I'm expecting 200 subscribers. I'm believing God for 200 subscribers. Because I know that I've not been consistent. That's the reason why my grit has been so bad. So bad. Like, so bad. But as long as I was consistent, I think I would have done better. Like, better than this. Like, the proven. The subscribers we have, the subscriber accounts we have is really good. But don't worry. Do not be afraid. I'm going to get better. Because I'm here. I'm back to be consistent. Things were restricting me, though. Because I was having issues with my phone. My laptop was giving me issues. Ah! Like, I don't know what happened to my laptop, but it's too many issues. It's the keypad, so. Well, I've changed the keypad and everything. And I was also looking for an editing software. I knew two, Sha. I knew, like, two that could work for me. But the one I found easy to use was the Wondershare Filmora. Filmora Naya, the Wondershare Naya. I don't know how to. I don't know if it's Filmora. Wondershare. But, bro, you pay $59 to access it. And I remember the act version of someone I, I couldn't even understand this because i'm not a tech pro like I, I don't really know things about things like that so i was like okay maybe i should just buy it i might check the price per month i think per month was 59 dollars yeah and me 
my savings was sixteen dollars, so it couldn't even get me anywhere. And I don't have a job. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? So I just kept that one on old for now, and I downloaded under editing software on my laptop. Unfortunately, I don't know how to use it. It's called VSDC Video Editor. I don't know how to use it. I'm gonna be trying to like get out to use it, but I've been don't worry, I've been exploring. Maybe that was how you said this, this video. You don't know. So that's that. All that goes do we have? Okay, so I've been taking online courses. Like now, I'm taking digital marketing course. I'm like, this world is going, like this world is already going technological. Everybody like, and it's like tech is bringing this money. And I mean, I'm going for where I could use going. Though I'm studying math because I'm following my passion. Because I talk a lot. Like the first thing you read about me is that I don't talk. If you first meet me, like Jesus, oh that's that that's it. If I'm not comfortable with you, you can't see me talking to you all the time. That is dirt. So I'm like going, I'm like looking for courses that will give me certification. So presently, I'm doing Google Digital Marketing course. And after that one, I'm planning on going. Hey, I'm planning on doing that UI UX design stuff. I feel it's simpler than coding because number one. I, did, I wanted to do coding one time because my brother was this interested in it and I'm like, police watching videos I'm like, what is this? What is this? I don't understand. Like, it was just looking like what I don't understand. Like, my brain couldn't just calm down and understand it. So I'm going to go for that course next after I finish the digital marketing course. And I'm satisfied. When I'm satisfied, I'll tell you guys about that. So, I also have business plan. So, recently, I just opened, I launched my shop. I like a shop. I'm a village person. I learned my stuff. The name is Shop Faves. I'll write the link to it. So I'll put the link. You should have follow me on Instagram. The major reason the business idea and everything was just to help people. At first, I was I'm very good at not really good at sewing, but yeah, I sew really too. I can't lie in clothes. I can only sew and cut. Maybe cut and sew. Yeah, with a little help. I think it's not hard. It's the sewing that's my problem. So I noticed that I could actually make handmade things, like make things for myself. And when I was going to school, I had an issue finding a tote bag plug. And when I even found one, it was it was bad. The quality was not good. The what the what I told them to customize on it, which was Philippians 413, which is I can do all things to price with strength. It was spilling off, like it was spe- if you see the bag now and when they brought it. It's not nice. The bag is the bag has suffered. The the inscriptions on it has spewed off and it's not nice. And I didn't like it. So I was like, oh, I had issues finding tote bags. Let me just start creating tote bags for people, like quality tote bags. So I met a friend of mine, asked her where did she get that material? So like, okay. I said, okay. I could decide to customize it. And if you want to customize your own, you could. So I was thinking of different ways I could design it. And not only making use of the regular tote bag material, because you no know, most people in school to carry their things and everything so that's what i've been up to doing the logo i first created the scratch then a friend of mine completed it like made it better because that was that yeah and i was planning on creating a website but i'm like don't let me jump up then just make use of this social media platform which is instagram for now i made my whatsapp yeah to just take orders and i've had orders like thank you for those that patronize me don't worry when the samples are available when i finish their products because i've already taken their Toes back to the graphic design now to put because the thing that is involved in that thing is screen print, they call it screen printing. I can't do it myself, so I've already made it that it's just for me to go there, tell them the design, and show them, and they should make it for me. That's it on period. Other things will be coming up because that's not the only thing I can make. I make I can make toast bags, I can make scrunchies, scrunchies for packing air. Don't worry, right now I make my hair. I will show you guys the scrunchie I made. And also, I can make bonnets. The bonnet out of bonnet cap. So, the other things we've been incorporating into the store data is the jewelry. Like, jewelry. Like, selling of jewelry. Because I really love jewelry. I don't wear them. You hardly see me wear them. Because. Wow. I don't know where to wear them. I don't know how to rock them. Mm-hmm. Sometimes, then my friend will be like, You're not even supposed to wear jewelry on this. You're supposed to wear on this. I'm like, I didn't know. And see, it's not my fault. So. Most of the times, I just put them in my bag, and I'm really, really soft on earrings and necklaces. So that's that. So we'll be incorporating that. Then the last one, maybe when I'm done with university, I'll be opening my clothing line. So that's on period, and that's that for the business goal. 
for my YouTube goals. Hmm, I want to eat like I don't know. This is what this this month is August. We still have August, September, October, November, December. So I I have a feeling that I want to eat like 500 subscribers. I don't know if it's possible, but I, wait though, it's possible though. I, I feel it's possible. So you guys should also support my journey. I think it's possible. I mean, I feel it's possible because you know if you go to the doctor sometimes. Then. Getting why eating you this year 500 subscribers. I believe I have faith. So that's YouTube goals for now. Being consistent and just uploading content and like I'm trying to invest in on gadgets. So I've been saving up. I've been saving up so bad as I am broke. As a sapa wants to suffocate me, but I refuse to be suffocated in Jesus' name. So. That is that on my life updates. I couldn't finish using my hair in this video. In the next video, I will lose my hair. Finish. So, thank you guys for. Well, wait, 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 wait. I want to, I want to advise people that are in university. Let me, let me, let me quickly put short, short notes. When you are going to uni, no matter what class you are, whatever you want to do, see, so don't just, don't just forget the reason you are there. Like number one, don't forget the reason you are there. Number two, if you are more of a social type, try and balance your social life with your school life. Do you understand? What I'm try and do that. Me, I'm social in meeting people because I remember in school I had so many friends. Like, how do you know this person? Is they, I, let me tell you my my trick. If I know one person in your room, I can totally know everybody. Just let me know your name. At first, I may mix their names. I can call Glory, Angela, I can go see. But let me just know your name. I will be there's no way I will not say I won't greet you. That's me. I will surely say hi, hello. Uh, that that's it. That's on period. So that's how I got to a uh, lot of friends. I had more female friends than male friends because I was afraid of male people because of so many things. So that's the wrap. Do not forget why you're there. No, just just be yourself actually. Be yourself. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, share to your friends, comment below your university life. Because I had the feeling that university is far different from what I knew university was for. So just comment. What has been happening to you lately? That's that. It's a wrap for now. Thank you guys for watching. God bless you. Thank you.